Forget Rio's crowded beaches and the carnival crush. We're going deeper this time, past the tourist traps and into the heart of what makes this country pulse. Join us as we explore 10 breathtaking, underrated travel destinations in Brazil that promise adventure and beauty beyond the usual tourist paths. If you love discovering hidden gems, don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps us bring you more amazing adventures. We start our journey in Joao Pessoa, capital of the northeastern state of Paraíba. This isn't some sleepy beach town, though God knows the beaches are stunning. We're at the easternmost point of the Americas, the Ponta do Seixas, where the sun first kisses Brazil each morning. The air is thick with salt and anticipation. Later, we'll cool off in the crystal clear natural pools of Picauzinho, a short boat ride from the coast. These aren't your typical tourist trap swimming holes. They're alive, teeming with colorful fish that dart between your legs. As the sun dips low, painting the sky in hues of orange and purple, we find ourselves at Hotel Globo, a local institution. Cold beers, greasy snacks, and the murmur of conversation create a soundtrack to the fading light. We leave the coast behind, venturing deep into the heart of Brazil, to the Parque Estadual do Jalapão in Tocantins. This is the Cerrado, the South American savanna, a land of dramatic contrasts. Imagine vast rolling plains, a sea of golden grass stretching as far as the eye can see, punctuated by towering rock formations. Hidden within this harsh landscape are oases of pure, refreshing beauty, the Fervedouros. These natural pools fed by underground springs are like something out of a dream. We're going to take a dip in the Fervaduro do Seca, it's water so buoyant you can't help but float. Locals believe these waters have healing powers, but Jalapao is more than just stunning scenery. We'll trek through the dunes, towering mountains of golden sand sculpted by the wind. Off the coast of Brazil lies an archipelago so pristine, so untouched, it feels like stepping back in time. This is Fernando de Norona, a UNESCO World Heritage Site where nature reigns supreme. Only a limited number of visitors are allowed on the island at any given time, a testament to the delicate balance between tourism and preservation. The real magic of Fernando de Noronha lies beneath the surface. We're talking about some of the clearest, bluest water on the planet, with visibility that can reach up to 50 meters. This is a diver's paradise, a chance to swim alongside sea turtles, dolphins, and countless species of fish in their natural habitat. Back on land, we'll explore hidden coves and pristine beaches, the sand so white it almost hurts your eyes. Fernando de Norona is about disconnecting, about slowing down and appreciating the simple things. Deep in the heart of Bahia lies a land of towering mountains, cascading waterfalls, and mysterious caves just waiting to be explored. This is Chapada Diamantina National Park, a paradise for hikers, adventurers, and those seeking solace in nature's embrace. Forget your Wi-Fi password, this is about disconnecting. The air here is cool and crisp, a welcome change from the humidity of the coast. We'll lace up our hiking boots and set off into the dense rainforest, our senses overwhelmed by the sights, sounds, and smells of the jungle. Our destination, Cachoeira do Sosego, a hidden waterfall accessible only by a challenging hike. Imagine cool, clear water cascading down moss-covered rocks, forming a natural pool perfect for swimming. As we hike, keep your ears open for the calls of howler monkeys, their guttural roars echoing through the trees. But Chapada Diamantina isn't just about physical challenges. Prepare to have your perception of reality challenged as we journey to the Lensua Marinenses National Park in Maranhão. This isn't your typical desert landscape, it's a surreal, otherworldly place where towering white sand dunes meet crystal-clear turquoise lagoons. Imagine walking across a sea of soft, powdery sand, the wind whipping around you, then stumbling upon a hidden oasis. The best time to experience this natural wonder is during the rainy season, from May to September, when the lagoons are at their fullest. We'll take a dip in Lagoa Azul, its water so blue it seems to glow from within. Keep an eye out for the local wildlife that thrive in this unique ecosystem, from tiny colorful fish to flocks of migrating birds. As the sun begins its descent, casting long shadows across the dunes, we'll climb to the top of one of the highest peaks. We're diving into the heart of Brazil, to Bonito, Mato Grosso do Sul. Forget crowded beaches and bustling cities, 
This is a place for those who find solace in the quiet embrace of nature. Bonito, meaning beautiful in Portuguese, is an understatement. This place is an underwater wonderland, home to some of the clearest, most pristine rivers and lakes in the world. We're talking visibility that can reach up to an astounding 40 meters, thanks to the high concentration of limestone in the water. Grab your snorkel and mask, we're heading to the Rio da Prada, one of the most famous attractions in Bonito. As we drift along the river, hundreds of fish, some the size of your arm, will swim right past you, unfazed by your presence. Get ready to hike through ancient landscapes and chase waterfalls in the heart of Brazil's spiritual center. This is Chapada dos Veadeiros, a national park in Goiás, where towering rock formations, cascading waterfalls, and a palpable sense of mysticism collide. We're talking about some of the oldest rock formations on the planet dating back billions of years. You can feel the energy here, a tangible sense of history and power emanating from the earth. Our hike begins in the lush vegetation, the air thick with the scent of damp earth and exotic flowers. We'll trek through dense forests, cross crystal clear streams, and climb steep trails, all the while surrounded by the symphony of the rainforest. Listen closely and you might hear the chatter of monkeys swinging through the trees or the shrill calls of exotic birds. Our destination, the majestic Catarata dos Curos, one of the most impressive waterfalls in the park. Imagine water cascading down a series of rock formations creating a series of natural pools perfect for swimming. Off the coast of Rio de Janeiro lies an island paradise, a place where time seems to slow down and the worries of the world melt away. This is Ilha Grande, a place of pristine beaches, lush rainforests, and a laid-back vibe that is impossible to resist. Forget the crowded beaches of Copacabana and Ipanema, this is the real deal. Ilha Grande is a place where you can truly escape. There are no cars on the island, only dirt roads and hiking trails. We'll lace up our boots and explore the island's interior, hiking through dense rainforest. We'll cool off with a swim in the crystal-clear waters of Lopez Mendes Beach, consistently ranked among the most beautiful beaches in the world. Imagine soft white sand that stretches for miles, turquoise waters that sparkle in the sunlight, and palm trees swaying gently in the breeze. Prepare to be blown away, literally, as we journey to Jericoacoara, a remote fishing village located on the northeastern coast of Brazil. This is a place where the wind whispers tales of adventure, the waves crash against the shore with a primal force, and the sunsets are the stuff of legend. Forget your fancy resorts and all-inclusive packages. Jericho Acoara, affectionately known as Jerry by the locals, is not your typical beach destination. This is a place for adventurers, for those who crave the raw, untamed beauty of nature. We're talking about miles of pristine beaches, where towering sand dunes meet the turquoise waters of the Atlantic Ocean. This is a paradise for kite surfers and windsurfers, who come from all over the world to ride the waves and experience the thrill of the wind whipping through their hair. But Jerry is more than just a playground for adrenaline junkies. It's a place where you can truly disconnect from the hustle and bustle of modern life and reconnect with the simple pleasures. Our final journey takes us to Pirinopolis, a charming colonial town nestled in the heart of Goyas. Forget the modern world, here, time seems to stand still. This is a place where cobblestone streets echo with history, waterfalls cascade down lush hillsides, and the air is thick with the scent of tropical flowers. We'll wander through Pirinopolis's well-preserved historic center, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, admiring the colorful colonial-era buildings. This is a town best explored on foot, allowing yourself to get lost in the labyrinthine streets and stumble upon hidden courtyards and charming cafes. But Pyronopolis is more than just a pretty face, it's a place steeped in history and tradition. From the wild Atlantic coast to the heart of the rainforest, we've explored just a glimpse of what Brazil has to offer. These hidden gems, these off-the-beaten-path treasures, are a reminder that the most rewarding journeys are often those that take us beyond the familiar. Thank you for joining us on this journey through Brazil's hidden treasures. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and explore these destinations yourself.